Hey hackers, welcome back to Shadow Painters. Today we are exploring shellfish, a fishing tool used for simulating real world fishing attacks. As always, this tutorial is for educational purpose only. Remember, unauthorized uses of these tools is illegal and unethical. I do not encourage anyone to do these illegal activities with these tools. This is strictly for our research and educational purpose. So let's know what is phishing. So phishing is a type of attack where it will trick users by imitating trusted websites. So let's consider our victim, let's say John. John receives an SMS that looks like very legitimate. It looks like it is from his bank. Let's say, and uh, in the email, in the SMS, it was mentioned warning him of suspicious activity. So he trusts the message and he clicks the link and he taken into the clone login page crafted by Selfish. So today we will see every step by step of the process how John gets hacked. Okay, for this purpose, we'll use the Kali Linux machine. And once you go to the terminal, before that, let's go to the GitHub. So this is the web, web page where you find the Git repository for Selfish. So if you go all the way to the code page, just copy this and go to the terminal, type command git clone and then paste the URL. So what happens is it will download all of the files which belongs to the Selfish here and created a directory for it. I think the file is quite big. Now let's wait some time. It's downloaded. Now we will change into the directory of shellfish before the type list files ls. Then you will see where is the shellfish is here. So cd shellfish clear ls to list the files. Now you can see all of the available files inside the. So before that, let's understand there are two script cells to run. One is shellfish and one is update shell. They are not highlighted because they do not have any permission to execute. But we have to convert these files to execute. If you execute them without without giving permissions, it will deny. You can see it. So now what we do is we can type chmod plus x and then shellfish.sh and then another one will give it to update dot sh clear. First I want to run update. Enter. So what you do is it will update all of the selfish directory. Maybe the one which we downloaded from uh, GitHub. It you see from past four years is not updated any. But here what we have is we have a shell that is updated for us. Where there is no files. Shellfish. Okay. Here we go. And also we have the shellfish now. Let's run the selfish. This is the main tool. Okay, now we are on the menu of shellfish. You can see now there are a lot of fake social media websites which are hosted here. This one also looks similar to social fish, the shellfish tool and social fish tool. They almost look similar. So here what happens is they they harvested social media websites here. So I will choose one of it. Let's go with the Facebook. And then now traditional login page or Facebook page, advanced voting, fake security login, Facebook messenger. Okay, let's go with the traditional login page for now. And then here, okay, now we have another option. What are these options? Localhost, ngrock, server.net and localhost.one. So this can give access to the public internet from your local machine. So whatever the option that you choose here, you choose the Facebook. Once you choose the Facebook, what happens is it will download the fake, fake Facebook login page to your local machine and keep it ready to launch into your local machine. But it is only accessible to the locally. But you want to give access to the public internet. So anybody have this link, they can also have the access. So now the most popular tool here within this, you can use uh, ng rock. It is also good, but you need to sign up for that. And then it is free sign up. After you sign up and you go to your account, you will see API token. So you can copy the token and then put it into the ngrock config file and then save it and then choose the ngrock. Then it will that work direct for you. But here I will go with the server one. This is fast and best. And then port. By default, most of the websites have 80 or 8080 ports. 
but uh, for here for demonstration right so i will go with the normal default port enter so you see now the website that you choose the facebook is now hosting into your machine is locally hosting at the same time it will forward with the help of server link you can see the server tunneling server tunneling and i have it here so you can right click and open if you see this page it looks like a facebook login page but this one looks very old maybe four to five years before I'm, i don't want to but let me explain here to something so here once you get you type shadow pen test the user definitely type shadow pen test and then click login immediately once you click login you will receive the account username and password this is how the attackers capture your social media login username and password with phishing attacks so this this all of this method is called credential harvesting so when i when you after you you click login it will directly take you to the real website so they will redirect it but i don't want to choose this because this facebook website the one which we have is very old so for that purpose i'm canceling this and then i'm running the shellfish again let me choose this time instagram and a traditional instagram and then i will choose servio default port okay so let's wait for at least 10 to 20 seconds then the link will be ready okay once you open the link it will take you to the instagram login page this one also looks very old shadow pen test In, uh, I'm, you can see after you input the username and password it will take you to the instagram page which is real instagram it is redirected the link but here we already capture the details for sure yes there you go instagram 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 yes so actually this is shellfish and uh, social fish they almost look very similar but they are very old if you want to try you can try go to youtube you can type shadow pen test okay this is my channel in this channel you can go to playlist in the playlist you can go to fishing attacks okay here you will see campfish and these are very updated one you can go for yes every fishing tool and the fishing tool heavy anchor should understand yes this one is very good it can bring you very advanced new project running social media website pages so that it looks very real very very real so these tools what i'm demonstrating are just for educational purpose but the, those tools are not now available they are very old there is no updates on that too so that is all for today this is the wrap